put these two together even though they're kind of spread apart on the test because they are closely related it's because they both deal with regular pentagons and the a sign is in the shape of a regular pentagon what does each angle measure remember if we want to find each angle in a regular polygon we will use n minus 2 times 180 getting the whole number of total number of degrees and then dividing it by the number of sides n okay so if it's 5 then we say what we're looking for is then 5 minus 2 times 180 divided by 5 or 3 times 180 divided by 5 or 540 divided by 5 which is 108 degrees that is each angle measure in a regular pentagon so that's number 22 but that also matters down here in 35 because a jewelry box is in the shape of a regular pentagon that means that every angle down here is 108 degrees 108 108 etc all the way around 108, 108, fun with colors, and 108. So if that's true, then you can see that they sum to 540. And what's the really relevant part of this is that um, it says the box uses two pairs of congruent right triangles to make made of foam to fill the corners. And what we're looking for is what's this angle measure? Well, that angle measure is going to be the linear pair with 108. So if it's a linear pair with 108, then they have to sum to 180. So we say, what's 180? Take away the 108 that is the angle at each vertex of a regular pentagon, and we find that the answer is 72 degrees. So x equals 72 degrees. Simple as that.